Hi friends and welcome back. In today's video, I'm going to be showing you what I use for my ASMR videos and how I set up. So I have some nail polish over there, some hand soap, coconut oil, some water to wash my hands, my microphone, and a towel to dry my hands, as well as some pearly ASMR gym chalk in this blue bowl. Oh, I also have my tripod, which is a gooseneck tripod, which I really love because you can play around with the angles. I also have a coupon for it um, in, the com in the description. If you haven't done so already, just hit that subscribe button. I greatly appreciate it. So let's get into the video. If you spend a lot of time playing with gym chalk like I do, your hands are going to get dry very often. So right now I just prepped them for the video. By washing them, I use some hand soap and just wash them in warm water. And then when I'm done with that, I just dry off my hands and then I go on to apply some coconut oil, which I use as a moisturizer. Guys, I legit just feel like I scrubbed in for surgery. <laughs> Gym chalk surgery. <laughs> okay, guys, back to business. So when I'm done with all of that, I go ahead and apply some nail polish. I'm not sure where I got this one from, but I really like the color, this nude color. I think it suits me very well. Anyway, guys, let me know in the comments. Like, do you like using long nails when doing ASMR or do you prefer to use short nails i prefer when my nails are short because that does not slow me down i feel like long nails are just going to mess up the entire process and even going to mess up my crushing style so i just want to know like what do you guys like to watch what do you guys do and i usually have to apply nail polish like every other day because of the amount of times i wash my hands in a day and when that is done i just give it a few minutes to dry The next step is I have my microphone mounted on this um, square mode. The reason I'm doing that is because the sides of the bowl are very high. And so I want the microphone to be over that so that it can pick up all the sounds. This is the Blue Yeti microphone. I honestly think it's the best for ASMR. Like you can control how much sound it picks up. And even though it's really expensive, I think it was a very good investment for my channel. So let's start recording.
Now we've come to the end of the video. Thank you so much for sticking around. Share with me in the comments how you prep for your ASMR videos. This is the light I currently use and it works better for my setup. Thank you guys and see you in the next video.